slash once for yes, twice for no. This is our yes, no light communication system. And it can be helpful to alert the handler that you need something like to be refueled. I'm adjusting the electronic system to make this new communication system possible. I've marked out the distance between the two eyes on this EVA foam. I'm also tracing the space for the small three circles. I'm going to use a razor to cut out all the holes. In the tiny holes, I'm going to thread through the small red LEDs. Then we're going to put our peephole eye and LED lights on top of that. We'll make sure the little red LEDs poke through our light ring. And then do the same thing for the other side. Get some soldering done. And then tape up those wires to make them a little bit prettier. The magic comes in with these little pressure switches. It has an always on condition. And then when you push the switch, you're connecting a new circuit so we can change to the color red. I'm going to install it in a bottle cap. And then glue that in the helmet where I can trigger it using some Jim Carrey style jaw movements. I'm diffusing the light using a piece of paper as well as a piece of packing foam. Let's do some quick soldering for our switch. Hot glued into our bottle cap. Then I'll hot glue it into the head so we can do a test fitting and try out those jaw movements. Conventions can be very loud. And this will serve as another communication option. But I can effectively communicate with my handler when I need her. 